I got a second chance, so it's different. If this is the first time, it would be different. A second chance, change it because like, you've been granted a second chance at something, so you take it more serious. It's been challenging, but I've got to push myself on from where I was. I was saying earlier, right, a lot of people get knocked down when it doesn't go well, and then they have challenges to bring themselves back up to where they was. I always stay in good spirits, so the challenge for me was to actually elevate myself past where I was. That's where the true struggle was. It wasn't to bring myself from ground zero up, it's to bring myself from up to even further. So what did you learn from coming back from that Ruiz? A lot, yeah, a lot. What, from the Ruiz one? Yeah, winning the title. Well, that was like, what I've learned that was just specific for that. Um, I learned a lot in terms of like training and how to adapt, learning quick. But this one I learned, I probably learned the most this one. I, can't, I don't want to say it's part of like my um, my game plan and stuff, but I feel like um, what I could say is uh, look at Rocky Marciano against all the the things he didn't have. Short short arms, not the best boxer. He made up for it through sheer hard work and becoming one of the most fittest heavyweights on the planet. And I think you have to be super conditioned to fight. Enjoy being the underdog. Yeah, it is fun, it is fun, it is fun, it is fun. Because I like the pressure has challenged me a lot. <coughs> boxing, when I was when I was winning, boxing is great. Life's good. Now it makes you realise what this game's about. It's challenging, very challenging. So yeah, it is it is good because I'm thriving under that pressure, but it's challenging personally because I want to do well. <coughs> Thank you, brother. I appreciate it, yeah.